Snow didn't stop people from coming out in Belvedere to support those in the crafting world. 13 News reporter William Ingo shows us what they did and how the city is helping. For Jane Flynn, quarantining over the summer gave the high school student time to support her passion. I made a couple rings for my friends and then someone was like, oh, you should totally sell them. And I didn't think anything of it, but I guess it kind of just boomed off. But as Flynn's business grew, she wanted to do more than make jewelry for her friends. The problem is that there wasn't anywhere to sell it something the Belvedere Chamber of Commerce wanted to fix. With there being so many local vendors in the Boone County area and even Rockford, that allowing a few of them to come in today and set up a table is great for them and great for us to find unique gift items for friends and family members. People like Flynn got to set up shop at the chamber for a socially distant holiday event, and the community came out in a big way. It's been great. We've had a ton of shares of the event on Facebook, so we've hit a lot of people. We've had constant traffic through the door since 11 a.m. And as the holidays continue to inch closer, small businesses want you to know that even a single small gift during the Christmas season can be a game changer for them. This is super important for me because getting gifts from other people, this will bring so much awareness to my business. and. You're not going to find this online like everyone else does. It's new and it's just, it's good to support work for people you know. Supporting small and supporting local so they can continue to grow this holiday season. For your 13 Weather Authority, William Ingalls, 13 News. The Belvedere Chamber of Commerce says the event also brought more business to stores and restaurants downtown.